Hello, hello, my name is Blair and welcome back to my playthrough of Final Fantasy 16. We're about to go save Jill because she got kidnapped. She's gonna be our Achilles heel, isn't she? Twice now, obviously after Sid, I'm a little bit terrified that she's gonna die because I like her. Um, but she keeps on being the one that I have to constantly protect, right? Even from herself or in this case from Titan. So I'm guessing we're gonna fight Titan and but we're gonna waste all our portions right before the fight on mini bosses. Anyway, let's go. Let's go and do out. that. Yes, yes you do. Um We had a kitty cat last time. Or I forgot the name. Couch, cow, scout, I forgot the name. Uh where is your courtyard light? Remember when I said that I can't see anything, Clive? I have this power that I could use, but no, no, no. <laughs> At least Gavlet killed some people here. High potions. How many do I have? I can't see them. Oh, there we go. Uh, four potions and two high potions and one strength tonic. Not bad. Oh, wow. Everything was smooth until the court here? Oh, that's cool. Don't you let her die. No, they won't let her die. They are waiting for you, dude. Yeah, you probably have to. I probably have to kill the executioner. Oh, baby girl. Gav. I hope you've got a plan, Clive, because we are fucked if you don't. I think we are fucked. <laughs> Kitty cat. Well, kitty dog. Dogster. <gasps> Why would you do this? I'm not even witnessing that technically. Whoa, what are you made of? It's a bloody wolf. I have never seen this. What is that? He is. Yeah, exactly. What a... <laughs> what? I, excuse me? This is amazing. Are you... Are you see... Not that guy. To go, go away. <laughs> you're, you're ruining the moment. Torgal. Don't tell me you tire of my entertainment. You, you need a, a whole spell or something. Yes. Your throat is. Perhaps it is time we served the main repast. You you also probably I should stop smoking. Ha. Uh, Torgo, oh my god. Stay close. We're getting Gav, you shouldn't be there. You Thank literally you. Thank you, Torgo, you're amazing. Yeah, no, I I would, but I genuinely don't know. I don't... Ah, that guy, yeah. Okay, cool. Now I can focus on you. Oh, by the way, I forgot to change some of my powers. Last night as I was... <laughs> I was reading, I figured out how to change the ones that I don't like. Ah! Uh, where are you guys? Okay. This is gonna work great for you guys. Could I please not? much power do you have by the way this 
Yeah, sadly, my... I wasn't sure where my life was. I definitely wasn't sure where my where his life was. Anyway, I left the house yesterday. I got a cold. Stay inside. <laughs> That's my advice for you. Close. Okay, now let's fight Titan. It's Freaking over. Howard sending everybody else. For now. But I bet that wasn't the last of them. Then they won't stop hunting us until Cook is dead. So you get in there and finish the job, eh? Go on. If they come again, we'll hold them out. Uh, you... All right. You could come. But what? Be careful. You could come with me. Oh, great. Uh, how much? Three potions. Okay, I'm good. How is Titan going to transform in this building? I mean, I promise you, Sid. 
He's going to destroy the entire... It's going to be a Breath of the Wild sort of thing. Tears of the Kingdom where the entire thing is going to die. Kuka. Hey. You're late. Trouble on the way. <laughs> Did we have an appointment? Your entertainment. How gratifying. Am I supposed to fight him with Sid? I... Oh gosh, I hope not. Have you come to defend your father's throne? No. Rosfield? Where did I come? Yes, actually, yes, yes. <laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler. An army. Yeah, that's my mom's even fault. Even a people. A veritable kingdom of dust. It's not wrong, though. Truly, I see no throne to defend. No! It's gonna hurt. They're just symbolic, Clive. Let it go. Enough of your games, Kuka. Just tell me what you want. Sid's head in a box. Um. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. Okay, well... And my <laughs> relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Your master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. <laughs> Yes, he did, but not the way you think. If you choose to play that murderous <laughs> Sorry, name, I couldn't... <laughs> then you shall answer for his crimes. Oh, goodness. The only crimes <laughs> I shall answer for are my own. Sid did everything in his power to save that woman, though she was long past saving. And so I did what he couldn't. Yeah, that's actually true. I kind of killed her. Long, well... Hugo. It was you. Hi. You. You killed her. Well, I did. I got her this close. And I am fortunate indeed. His hair is extending. <laughs> I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. He's dead, dude. He w it wouldn't make a difference. But it seemed I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. Scared. We shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. And she would sleep with everybody else. <laughs> she would be my queen. <laughs> or that. <laughs> and together we would rule like the gods we are. But you crushed that dream, ground it into dust. You, you can find another girlfriend. I'm sure. I think, I don't know. maybe this is not the way you should present yourself on a first date, but overall, my mom is very open to everyone, too. And what of you? How many people have you killed? How many dreams have you crushed? I have a point. But we did the same, Clive. You're not the only one who's seen their world fall apart around them. You'll get no pity from me, Kuka. No pity. And no mercy. I don't think he wants your pity. Now die! Woo! Ha <laughs> ha ha! Deadly. 
I don't know why, but like my body temperature has risen. Like I can feel my cheeks <laughs> burning. Can we be friends now? We can solve it with a cinnamon bun. I swear to you, you're gonna find another girlfriend. I get it, she was nice. I get it. Everybody loved her, I get it. A lot of people loved her, a lot. Too much, if you ask me. No, 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 Oh, 
don't like you. Neither did your girlfriend, by the way. Not enough to be just with you. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Actually, it's my dad's, but... What the heck? Jesus! <laughs> wow, I can't. I actually was so scared that I was about to die. I have a cat fur right in my eye. Really annoying. Heartbreak is hard, but like, get over it. Ow, I, I feel like I am getting defeated right now. What did just happen? <gasps> I. I didn't mean to. But you know, can I cut your. Right now, since, um, yeah, you have to, you have to kill him, otherwise he's going to chase you around. Son of a oh no, 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 he's turning. He's turning. I don't want to fight Titan, I just finished. I know this game is kind of like this. What is, oh my god, I'm taking in Titan. I didn't even fight him. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Um, I will. You can bleed to death like that, right? You have a lot of. Yeah. Puka. Oh. Well, I tried. A little bit upset. I understand too. You. <laughs> there, there. You mustn't get yourself worked up. <laughs> Wait. That's that's Gav, right? Another time. No. Ethos. That is not Gav. Oh, 
boys, girls, we did it, we did it! <laughs> High five. <laughs> That's Gav. Oh my god, my dog is awesome. Munch, 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 munch. Well, I... Is that all of them? I always said that we don't give him enough treats. So. Well, Luda scum. Who the fuck invited them? Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? <laughs> From there. Not telling, eh? Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. She has to kiss me. I grew. I earned my kissing points. I so earned. <gasps> no, 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 no. 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 Hi. You missed one. We were worried. You look beautiful, splattered in blood. <laughs> I was so close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. Yeah, me too. I think I have Titan now. Sid is gonna go when away. When did the Royalists arrive? Right after you went inside. Just when we thought we were shot of Titan's lot. In pile Odin's. Of course. Not enough of them to worry us, though. No. You didn't see the one who took Kukra away. It's not one of them. It's an Ultima. So, what? You think they came here to save him? I'll be fucked if I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. I think he's plenty away. It feels what like Ultima do? is picking up dominance, kind of like the one we fought the first time, and using them despite them being dead. We go back to but the I could hideaway. be wrong. She needs a shower. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks <laughs> of it. After what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kuka later, shall we? Jill, how about my puppy? I... He turned into a All right. daredevil dog. Gives a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. He's not a mud. He's a. I, I can tell right now. I will tell you after. Hey, how are you feeling? Ready to go home? Home. Sometimes we have to leave it behind. Music is so different all of a sudden. Just look at the state of you. You're more of a wreck than this place. Okay, thanks. Is this what you call taking better <laughs> care of yourself? No more excuses, your ladyship. I order you to rest. <sighs> Fine. I'll rest. I mean, seriously, just give her a NyQuil. She's gonna sleep through the night. If you give me a NyQuil, I have 16 hours sleep. One pill. Don't worry, Gav. She's in good hands. But we should have never let her fall into Hugo's. Back when he had some light. The question is, where is he now? And what the hell were those wireless doing there? Hmm. I was wondering about that all the way home. I'll tell me I've heard something. I'll talk to him. And I'll talk to Tomes. The Lawsman? About what? I should probably... About your faithful hound for Star. Oh yeah, so that's if sending us there. If good friends ever done that before, I'm betting Tomes will look at what Alan always... What happens afterwards? It's all well and good talking saving our asses, but if it costs him what it costs him... Oh, right. yeah. That will do. Um, let me see if... <laughs> Sorry. Joe. Listen to Talia. Be a good girl oh, no. and go to bed. Thank you. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Okay. <laughs> I cannot catch a break. I want to see what my dog is. Oh my god. Wind up a singular strike that increases the potency in pot potency when charged. 
Yeah, I will have to go... Oh, that. Titan block. That looks good. Okay. Um, we're gonna go... I'll have to go in the menu by myself and uh, potentially change this guy with Titan. But Snow Cloak. Now he's a Snow Cloak. See? I don't know what that is. But that's cool. And I'm obviously not gonna use it. How do I use Titan? Do I have to change? Oh, here we go. Okay, so if I removed him, I can put Titan. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I, I will decide this in my free time because it's a lot to look over, right? But cool, cool, cool. We have Titan. I have a feeling I'm going to like him more than Sid, but what I don't like about Sid is that power that uh, where he uh, aims and I think I can change that and I, then I think I'm gonna be Sid Titan um, and mine of course. Let's talk to Otto. I mean he just sits there all the time. Yeah, there's no way. I don't think he's in this universe. There he is. All right, Clive. Fiery youth. Still busy saving the world. Youths. I uh, oh, beautiful hair. Mid. When did you get back? Just now. What about your studies? Oh, mum. Uh, Dad. So Hugo Cook invaded Rosaria. All the canvas in uproar about it. He's gone mad. He's turned real. It'll be yours next. You try concentrating beyond that. All right, all right, <laughs> you win. How long will you be staying this time? So now, a while most likely. Any road while I'm here, I would hope you could do us a favor. Mid, you can't just expect me to. Please oblige her. Is that mom? Well, we are busy tracking down Cooker. You should have a little time to spare. Professor, now no. there's a face I haven't seen in a while. Should sure you have been buried in it or still toe? <laughs> I did, till a familiar trill pricked my ears. As ever, your exuberance is a breath of fresh air, which successfully scattered the painstakingly assembled fragments of my thoughts. Just like that. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> well, glad you were the professor. So, I'll meet you in the storeroom when you're done. Wait, hold on. Breath of fresh air. <laughs> like Tempest, more like. That's just because you have to race her. We're just enjoying it. Otto, you got my guilt. Huh? My fee for bringing Mid across. <laughs> <laughs> You're paying for the Uber. Story, was it? I wonder what Mid's plotting. Yeah, let me go talk to her. I want to see if there are a side quest, but I can't see anything. Shouldn't you be getting some rest? You took your time. I'm a busy man, Mid. I'll get to the point then. I want to turn the room down there into a workshop, like the one I had at Dad's place. You... And I've been thinking. Dad said I had a knack for engineering. Told me everything he knew about it. Then sent me off to Canva to learn everything. That was his dream for me. But one day I put my studies to use for the. But I'm hoping no one's to quit school. I've studied enough. It's time I put. I know that I can help the people here, and I want to do. Well, well, well. It's all right. Sitters. Oh, it's Sid's daughter. Yes, not uh, not uh, Otto's. Yeah, that's true. A list of jobs for, you. for me. Who else? What do you want me to do? First things first, I need equipment and materials to start making my own. There's the designs for the stuff I need and the stuff it needs smithing from. The other materials I can work myself. Just need a generous benefactor to lay Apart from the wood, I'll need a carpenter for that. Well, I can just hurry up. Is that everything? <laughs> Where to start? Materials and tools. That means carrying a blackthorn. Okay, cool. <sighs> Is she technically our kid now? Because, um, well, Honestly, I, I'll take it. I'll deal with the teenager better than I'll deal with the toddler, I think. I think they're more interesting. I mean, no, probably not. It's probably all ages offer the different uh, no tricks again. different joys, but uh, in this Jill, context, definitely with the teenager. Because I think, I feel a toddler would be really hard to keep alive here. Wondering where you've made back from Plumber. I know. Just now. <laughs> She's planning to set up a workshop in the, the list. 
It's going to be like one of those. Uh, what is the pharmacy that has the super long Thank receipt? You can find everything on that. Nice one. Excellent. It's paid. Hundred times. If it weren't for her filters, we'd have not to drink but light. Indeed, it would. I'll send us. Thank you. Thanks, Sharon. Blackthorn. It was a little. I have a commission. She requires certain. I actually want to go talk to Tons and talk about the twins. Last time I talked in private, I saw that, but I didn't want to talk. To I didn't want to go hell. through the conversation in private. My thanks. So to speak, private. When I wasn't recording, that's what I, I just mean. Just leave the time. Let's see if bottles available. Where is he? No. I'll never uh, get used to the maps. Completely the opposite. Okay, great. Um, Excuse me? The pier, right? He's on the pier, okay. I have the power of Titan. I have the power of Titan. I'm so happy about that. I am so excited to try it. I'm actually so excited to go through what I thought about it last night. As I was, I don't know if I uh, actually said this. As last night I was reading, I read before I go to bed, and I realized how to change the powers that I don't like. Uh, and I think I'm gonna go that, but I, of course I forgot to do it. Oh no, I have to do it. That's right. I'll ask him. There was also one. Oh no, this is this guy. Sorry, yeah. Am I going in the right direction? I love myself, like a sister. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round. <laughs> the Empire have dragoons. They have a freaking dragon. His name is Bahamut, and he's my brother. Oh, Hi, Mark. What brings you to the rest? Uh, oh, I don't mind if he don't. Thank you, Martha. He went up to Cressida on business. No idea what. As far as I know, he's still there. I'll look from there. We're, um, he's still here. We have not checked out our puppy. Okay, we'll we'll check it out with this. Let's go find ourselves our carpenter. You know what I should use that I never actually use those uh, training. Please teach me how to fight. Those training places we have them in the um, in the hideaway. Because then I could test literally my powers and I should do that, but I have so little time free that I end up neglecting it. Am I going in the right way? Yes. Not so much neglecting it as not having time for it, but that would be a good way to test my powers and be a little bit more prepared when I see you guys. I knew she was in some bushes around me. That's where she always is. Hi guys. All right. No, I don't have time for that. I have to find myself a carpenter. Oh, by the way, I have no potions whatsoever. I have one. You do, Bernard. Martha said I might find you here. Oh, you know. Oh, that's weird. Building a workshop, you say? Well, that beats stacking boards to bridges, sure enough. And? If Martha didn't mind me being gone away. Oh, yeah. Of course. Well, that there is Cressida, where I grew up. Hmm. Ain't much. But I came up here hoping to visit. 
I even patched up the bridge to get across. Only to find the plane. Oh, finds uh, means uh, demons, by the way. Dealing with beasts and vocals, it? It's the least I can do. Thank you, Kai. Um. Because I had to Google it. That's literally. I can't really see what's happening. Vulture. Oh, what? What is spitting poison at me? Okay. I just don't feel like... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I know what you are. Kicking my ass. Okay. He was kicking my butt. Almost. Almost. That should do it. <laughs> you made short work. I wouldn't say so, but it, they're dead. So, how long is it since the village was abandoned? Oh, well. Oh, people started packing their things after the dead she fell. Between the blight and the... <laughs> Must be nigh on a decade since the last wagon left. Oh, it may as well have been a century. Looking at the place. It's in the crest I remember. I'm sorry. Ah, don't be. Can't live in the past. As soon as I'm done saying a prayer for those that raised me, I'll meet you there. That's true. And I mean, you can build a future just as great. That should take care of me, little list. Then I head back before she thinks of it. Anything else? She scares me. <laughs> okay, um. Okay, let's go talk to her. 
And I don't know if we have time for Tom's. I mean, I hope so. I'm really curious about my puppy. Okay, where is... I, I will constantly get... My, my purpose in life will be to get lost in places like this. Is she a buff there? I'm hoping so. I forgot where she was, of course. Oh, there she is. Go and help with her experiment! I am. I placed your various orders. That's brilliant. That's Is there? Nope. Black box as soon as they. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> That's awesome. She's very much Sid, right? She's a little bit rebellious, a little bit like, don't tell me what to do. Love it. She's adorable. Day for the day done. Let's see how Jill's faring. No, we're not going to Jill. We are going to Tom's first. We're going to check our puppy and. Um, then some side quests because I don't I don't know if I should take the side quest. We're not going uh, to jail. We're time. going directly to jail. Oh yeah. Starting a shortcut. Uh, Recovering, but she still needs her rest. Of That's course. It. Take a careful one, you. I'll do my. Oh, Gav was looking for you. He said he had something to show you. The shelves. Oh, that's right. You went to ask a Oh, must have found. Okay, let let me go talk to him instead. Um, I did wanna. Okay, let me go talk to Tom's about the twins. Uh, depending who's closer. I should get by you, but I don't want to spend an hour searching for a freaking creature and then have having to Google it. Have you dressed my girlfriend? She doesn't know yet, but she will be my girlfriend. I think. I think she likes me. Clive, where have you been? <laughs> You've been investigated, I've been to ask you something about talk. Where did you get him? Like, in the first place? I don't know. Uh, my father brought him back from nowhere crossing the snowfield when we heard his cries and was seeing no sign of it. What do you reckon, Torms? It certainly adds weight to the theory. Clive, I believe that Torgal may be no mere hound, but a rare frost wolf, an animal native to the far northern reaches of Vanisthea. I told you in it's a Malamut. Best theories, I found reference to a frost wolf who served as guardian to an ancient queen of the north. Such was his mastery over ether, he could cast magics on command. His name was Fenrir. Fenrir the Frostwolf. <laughs> now, the animals do not state it explicitly, but I have reason to oh, believe that of course, this makes queen sense. was a dominant of Shiva, So before Jill? A girl from the Northern Territories and her faithful husband. He was in Jill's One hands at the start. As the dominant of Shiva. You're saying that Jill granted to all his... What? <laughs> Just like Fenrir, people called him my hound, but... Torgal and Jill were inseparable. He grew up as a faithful companion to the Dominant just when his master needed him the most. You're right. If it weren't for Torgal Black, she needed him. The kingdom come. Jill yes. would have been for it. She Quite. needed him. His latent birthright as a frostwolf. It had only to be unlocked. Oh, get you, Torgal. <laughs> You're an even finer hound than we thought. <laughs> I oh. always thought he was the perfect puppy. And regarding your original concern, you need not fear for Torgal's health. Oh. Why, the beast has the appetite of a behemoth. Just this very morn, I found him with his nose buried in my nuts. Are they good for dogs? There you are! I've been looking everywhere for you, Bernadette. I need you to introduce us so we can get to work. <sighs> I Why? shall be a moment. <laughs> Can't you just say hi? First off, does that mean that I have to marry her so I can keep my dog? Because technically it's his, her dog. Like, my hands are tied. I am so sad about this, but, you know. <laughs> it is. Well, I couldn't have done it without you. You and everyone else, but I promise I'll pay you back. I'm going to work this thing to the bone for you, right? <laughs> just you wait. I'll make wonders like this. Then I look forward to seeing them. Now that that's settled. I wonder if Vivian's made any progress tracking down Kuka. Um, let me go to Tom's to talk about the twins, and I think it's uh, we're gonna take this next episode. Uh, but yeah, let's let's go to Tom's first. I want to see what 
they had to say about the twins. They clearly were important because they were one separate discussion. Uh, and then tomorrow we're gonna take the side quest, get ourselves some extra HP because we are getting our butts almost kicked. One thing you know, I was thinking here. yesterday that how bad I am at the game because I'm getting my, my butt almost kicked. And then I realized, actually, I used to get it kicked all the time and now it's almost kicked, which is a little bit better. <laughs> That's progress. Here are the twins and let's... Hi, guys. Can I love you? No. Tons. My knowledge is yours. Oh, there we go. Did you know? So both of their parents were bearers, having lived so long in a world where so much has denied them. It could not have been easy for them to find love. But once, but they, once had... they had, oh, how brilliant did it burn? A love that only burned brighter once Tet and Crow. Pro were there to bask in it, to share it. Until it was taken away. Plunging the twins into a darkness no man or woman, let alone child, should ever face, have to face. A pal that will, a pal, a pal? That will ever hang over us as long as the man who cast it walks free. Oh, so their parents were killed. Okay, let's go with that. What did we? Okay, this is this is very very long. Um, oh, Frostwolf. Okay, well we know about it. The Man of the Rock. Do we know about that? A private army. Yes, we know about that. Um, I think I think it's way too much to to go through it. But maybe just let's go through the bestiary. And why is this not shown? I think we haven't seen them yet, but we heard of them. And we have three left, that's it. Oh, I wanted to read about Odin. Okay, let me see. A warden of Galarcus who rides into battle atop of his spectral steed and whose black blades is said to be sharp enough to split the very seas in twice, I guess, in, in two. His latest dominant. Okay, yeah, King. Barnabas of, oh, I want to check this out, actually. I think that, yes, that is the, uh, the guy we saw uh, Benedicta with. So the third, but, well, technically he's not the third because he was at the same time with Hugo. So the second boyfriend of Benedicta. So he is Odin. Oh. My God, guys, guys, can you please just stop complicating well, things? <laughs> it's becoming both um, complicated Jesus, in every way, God. both uh, political and on, in terms of feelings and relationships and whoo. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Uh, have a fantastic day, stay amazing. Drink your water, wear your SPF, and I'll see you tomorrow with... Hopefully, Jill is gonna wake up, but that's fine. She needs to rest. So we'll let her rest while we take some side quests. And then... Um, then continue with all of this. And we'll speak with Vivian. I always like Vivian lessons because they clear up things in a more entertaining way for me because they are, you know, they show me videos. <laughs> I don't have to read stuff. Uh, but also the way she tells them, they make more sense, it clicks with everything. So yeah, we're gonna do all of this tomorrow. Until then, stay awesome. Bye-bye.